we're here, I'm in the closed guard, or whatever, and then we break the guard. Once the guard gets broken, you know, of course his legs may go to configurations like Delahiva and all this, okay? But once I break the guard, I wanna put my leg here. See, I put my leg here so that I'm trying to keep out of that Delahiva position. Looks like I'm starting to, to uh, pass the guard. Instead, I'm gonna scoop up the leg. My left foot's gonna come right over here to the hip. I'm gonna fall to my left side. Again, not towards my back. I'm gonna fall to my left side so I can get this leg lock started. And then once I'm here, this hand here, control, okay? So that he's gonna be moving this leg around as I'm holding it, I'm already going to work with one arm and I get the tap, just like that. It's real simple. And again, what I'm doing is I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. I'm taking it like this. If you guys can see, look. I'm, I'm tr pulling his toes in and then my body is driving this way, creating a toe hold. And you can do this with one arm. Now, as far as legal, the legality of it, as far as I understand it, it should be legal. I can't imagine a referee being able to determine that you are doing something illegal, even though it is a different mechanism, how it's breaking the foot. Um, I can't imagine them saying that this is a toehold, even though that's what it is, okay? So, should be allowed, okay? So, I'm in the closed guard, the guy's trying to hear, we're grappling, I get this knee inside, looks like I'm trying to pass the guard. You know, just defend a little bit, like, you're, uh, yeah, there we go. Boom, I drop in, this hand's controlling the foot, and I get the tap. Okay, again, back in the closed guard, I'm trying to open, Very loose and relaxed, because I want to slide all the way back. Try to use your leg. You okay? Yeah. How are you doing? Starting. <laughs> okay, all right, let's call it good. Hope you guys enjoyed. Teach me grappling. Thank you, Eric.